So, hello everybody, welcome back to our channel. Well, my channel, it's not our channel. It's definitely not our channel. So, today's vlog is a very exciting one. I started with the clips of this whole process. So we've got a new car, which is really, really exciting. Um, but basically, I've had to cut this video in half with another video that's going to be going up on Tuesday because I was shooting and filming for PLT and I filmed loads of behind the scenes but the stuff isn't live on the site yet. Are you okay? It's not live on the site yet so I can't post those clips until they're live. So yeah I just thought I'd explain what's going on in this vlog. So basically I vlogged Sunday through till Wednesday. Wednesday's the day we got the car. However, I put Wednesday's clips at the start just because I had loads of other um, footage and I thought you guys are probably interested in us getting the car. So Con went and got the car on Wednesday. Um, so you'll see Wednesday's clip first. So you went and got the car and then you brought it back and then, yeah, we didn't really vlog much on that day just because I was so busy. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to give a little context and then after these clips from Wednesday, um, it will be back to Sunday and then I can do my H&M haul, my cleaning haul and stuff like that. And you guys will see that. But yeah, little man is getting a bit annoyed. What's wrong? Do you like the new car? No, okay. No, even though you can see out the window. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoy this vlog. And yeah, let's just get into the video. I don't even think we spoke really much about what car it is. You've posted a video of it, haven't you? Really? Because I didn't really, because I had to crop, I had to crop quite a lot of out because obviously I didn't think at the time, but I got loads of the house in it. I didn't really want that to be what we had done. So yeah, so basically we've got a grey Discovery Sport. Discovery Sport. It's not it brand has, new. No, it's it's a '67 play, which is still quite new. Three, three years old, three and a half years old. We don't need a brand new car. Like even nice. this is bougie for us. But um, it has got car, seven. Right? Yeah, it has got seven seats. If we want them, they're folded down. So this is just like our family car. Keep them on, them, man. For the future, for all our, for all our bubbers. For all our bubbers. And the dog. Um, so yeah, I guess that's everything. And yeah, I don't know. I'm very, very happy with this car. I feel very grateful and very lucky to be in the position. Well, we both do. Both feel very lucky to be able to have this car. So, yeah, let's get into the video and I hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> Say good morning, everybody. <laughs> so, today is a very exciting day, but I'm gonna talk to you guys in a bit when I'm getting ready um, about what's going on. So, yeah, I'll see you guys then. So, Noah's ready to go to Nanny's again. Yeah, Daddy's ready to get the car. Get back in there. <laughs> Are you copying him? <laughs> How did you know that was coming? So I'm just gonna do my fake tan. That's the TV by the way and my lighting's on, I do apologize. I'm gonna sort my hair out. You're gonna see me looking a little bit more glam. Um, when I'm ready, I'll talk through everything about today. Um, but for breakfast, I've currently got a hot chocolate. This is the salted caramel. It's good, it's got the ice effects in there already. Perfect. Yeah, it's real nice. Is it? Can I see my seat? Wow. I'll, I'll show you the outside, but I'm obviously gonna wait for them to leave because it's a bit embarrassing. <laughs> Oh my god! But I don't want the car to lock, but I'll take the key. Oh my god, imagine, no, imagine if you did that and you locked the key in there. Woo woo! Oh god, I'm so excited. No, I'm happy with it, it looks sick. Set your phone up, like... I'll ring you back in a bit. Okay, I love you. Love you, bye. Bye. So you guys, I'm back. Sorry about the lighting in here. I know it's not great, but um, yeah, you would have just seen that little clip. So basically Connor's just got the car. Um, they did a contactless delivery. So that was how we got the car. But yeah, you kind of got to see a little sneak peek of the car, which is so exciting. Um, I will obviously talk all about it once um, it's here and we can go through everything. Um, me and Connor can have a nice little chat with you. 
yeah so that's really really exciting i actually cannot believe that's our new car like my dream is to own and i know i could dream about having better cars but for me personally i am obsessed with range rover velars they are like top for me i love them so much um so the fact that we've got this car is just absolutely crazy because these are the kind of cars you see drive past and you think oh my god that's so nice and we've got it like i actually haven't been getting too excited about it normally when i have something exciting coming up i can't sleep the night before but i slept fine last night which is great that's a good update for you guys i slept phenomenal last night which was amazing um but i just haven't got too excited because i still can't believe it's happening i know to some people like a car and stuff is like the word that comes to my head is like superficial but um this car is actually going to be our family car for a while so me and connor have had our current car which is lovely i highly recommend this car um to anybody i literally love our clio such a nice drive um my first car was actually a ka <laughs> the worst ka you've ever seen connor had a little red corsa and then we both shared the clio um and now we're both going to be sharing this car which is so exciting so basically we've kind of just outgrown the Clio. Um, having two car seats, we needed more space and just like practicality wise, like having to put Noah in the car and stuff. One thing I will say, this car does, the Clio doesn't have a light in the back. So when we take Noah out um, and we need to put him in his car seat at night, we cannot see what we're doing. And we were just getting so fed up with silly little things um but honestly you'll know if you have a child putting your child in a car seat and stuff honestly breaks your back um so we we wanted out of choice to go for a higher up car um we were looking at getting an estate car because i just know that the boot space connor's parents have got an estate and it's honestly so roomy and what we just wanted was space and a car that's going to last us a while because we're going to want a dog in the future um, not that we're gonna have a massive dog we want a sausage dog so they don't take up a lot of room to be fair but we just wanted to have somewhere that we can have our double pram in it's gonna fit and there's still gonna be room because also when we'd like even pick up friends in our car with the car seat in there literally there was no room so Noah's actually had to sit behind me in our current car because he his feet basically touch Connor's seat they do on mine as well so we're gonna have more leg room which is great and that means he can go back behind Connor so I can actually... Because when we're in the car, I can't see Noah because he's behind my seat. So yeah, just loads of things, little things that made us want to change our car. Um, and I'm so excited for it to be here and for it to be ours. And I just cannot believe it. I'm really nervous to drive it, actually. Yeah, and if you would have seen my vlog the other day, this car was on my vision board. Now, this is crazy. Like, obviously... I put that car on my vision board because we had an idea that was the car that we were going to get like we knew we wanted discovery sport um but all the cars we were looking at were the gray ones always came out more expensive and that just seems to be the case with any car um but i put the gray one on there because that was our vision i would have been so happy to get a white one or a gray um, or a black one um and then literally i think the day after i posted that vlog we found this car and it has the exact same wheels on it which is crazy like i would have been happy with normal wheels i didn't need black wheel rims on my tires like i don't <laughs> i don't care um and then we found this one and we contacted them and yeah it's here now we've got it within a week so i just think i'm really positive about this year and it's just such an exciting start for me and connor and it's just it's, it feels like such an achievement to even be able to afford to do this it's just crazy like i don't want to get like really deep about it because i know it's just a car but it's a massive milestone it really is especially connor's dad is like a massive car lover and he's going to be so jealous and i already know he is jealous he's like oh can you drive it past because obviously we can't see anybody anyway so we can't see show people the car Connor's dad was like, can you just drive past my house? 
Um, so yeah, that actually in isolation as well because Connor's mum tested positive as you would have seen in my last vlog. I'm just excited for a heated seat, to be honest, because my back at the moment needs it. <laughs> oh my God, there's so much room in the back. That's... Look how much room in the back. That's with my seat all the way where I want it as well. So it's really good leg room. <gasps> you guys. This is such a milestone for us together and we're so proud of each other because we are in such a different place in our lives. Even to a year ago, like we're, yeah. I just so, I literally just, I don't know. So you guys, Con's back. Let's let go. Oh, so nice. We've just been shooting for PLT. She's nice, isn't she? she is lovely. This is our old car. And this is our new car. Oh my god, let me get this. I've never been in a car like this before. Oh. Whoa. Oh my god, I don't want to get in it. Wow. Look how much space there is on the really camera. Bad, isn't it? Oh my god. We can do drive with me's. Oh look, 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 there's a guy, the guy. Look how much leg room there is at the back. <laughs> that guy's looking. Is he? Yeah. Look how much leg room there is at the back. Oh my god. It's so nice. Yeah, it doesn't feel massive in here though, which is great. Because I've been worried to drive it, but it doesn't it doesn't feel huge. I reckon I could drive this easy. Turn it on then. So when you put it in reverse, does it not come up on there? Well, I put it in reverse. Obviously don't reverse. Obviously. Oh yeah. How is it to drive? Unreal. Really? Is it like... I need to work out what these buttons. Yeah, we do need to work out what these... What the hell does that mean? Is that four wheel drive? And I think four wheel drive. What's that? That's Gradient. going downhill. So if we're going down that steep one on the downs, we just push that? I think so, I don't really know. <gasps> Hazards are there. That's my heated seat, that's your heated yeah, seat. Yeah, it heats up well quick. Oh my god, I've got so much room. I could possibly have a baby in this car. <laughs> it's, a, it's a possibility. It's so nice. Uh, can we talk about you, Mr. Influencer? <laughs> He got approached by a management. I don't. I think they do it to everyone. No, they don't. Why would they do that to everyone? <laughs> but why? Do they they called you a micro influencer. What's a micro influencer? A teeny tiny one. Yeah, but they're asking what I want, like for a, like a free, a free. Is uh, it like a legit company as well? A cause... free, a free frame story. Yeah. That's why I didn't know what to fill in. That's why I'm leaving it to right, you. Right. Okay. I'll, I'll sort it out all for you. Obviously. I mean, I'm not the most clued up, but I know this management is genuinely a good management. I know. I was, I've spoke to them before. I was like, the people who follow like, them then. I was like, looking at the people who follow them, I was like, what? Yeah, they're genuine. They're a really good management. Good things are coming, my love. All right, shall I show you the boot? You can't show me the boot because you're so close Let's, to the... I'll move forward a little bit. That's literally so big. Grey colour, which is our favourite. Um, and then it's got, are they, what, they, what are they just black? Alloys. Alloys. Oh, look at the size of the wheel. Christ. Oh, I must put a car seat in. <laughs> yeah, we need to go pick up Little Man in a minute. But look how nice it is. That's the back. It's got seven seats on. Look at the size difference. So, we're going for our first drive in the car, well my first drive, um, so we're going to go, we need to go get some fuel, we were going to pick up a little while but I have so much work to do, it's actually stressing me out, um, so I feel really bad but he's going to have to stay at my mum's tonight, um, I don't really like to, I don't like to be apart from Noah but I have got work that I have to do. And I can't, I physically can't do it when he's there. Yeah, it's so nice. Do you love it? Yeah, I do, yeah. 
so good afternoon guys it is saturday afternoon and we are just chilling connor's here i'm not going to show you connor because he needs a haircut and he hates being on the camera when he needs a haircut so i wanted to start a new vlog because i vlogged last week i still need to finish editing up my vlog for this week it's going to go live tomorrow which is sunday because basically i edited the whole thing yesterday and the reason I've got this, which is what we were just talking about, was a hard drive, is because I have issues with my Final Cut Pro every time. But I think I might have sorted it anyway. I'll have to see this time I'm editing. Um, but I ended up losing the whole file yesterday, which was so annoying. Because I'd edited the whole video and it was ready to go, and then it wouldn't export because it was I didn't have enough storage on the laptop. Because the so yeah, it was just because it doesn't export. My issue is basically it doesn't export because the files, for some reason, Final Cut, like, saves the, like, backup files. Look at the snow in Chorley. I know, they've got snow everywhere except here. Um, they save all the backup files and it takes up so much storage on my laptop, like, stupid amounts. Like, it's like 60 gig. I, I don't even know how. And then I can't export the video and then, yeah, it's just an issue. Just had a massive H&M parcel come. So this is full of H&M Home Star. So we can open it together and go through it together and I'll show you what I picked up. Hello my little monkey. Uh, you want to get to mummy? Uh, uh, okay, hang on then. Look at you. Come here. Come here. Did you have a nice nap? Yeah. I mean, you didn't even nap. Did you? Hey, can mommy open her parcel? Yeah? Oh. <laughs> Don't touch it, no. Don't touch it. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Let's get this open, okay? Hang on. Are you trying to help mommy? I've got a new cushion cover. We've got a few cushion covers actually. This is just a little hooded bath towel because I feel like it's going to be nice for Noah to have his own and then... How cute! Dada, look! Yay! Oh! Oh! Careful! Where's Noah gone? Ooh. Boo! Where's he gone? Can you say peekaboo? Can you say peekaboo? Oh, what are you doing? And then I've got this cushion cover. I just like a very like neutral, monochrome kind of vibe. This is the new bath mat. Again, very on the same colour scheme. This other cushion cover. I'm going to put this all on and then I'll show you once it's done. I'm going to clean in here. I mean, it's pretty tidy in here anyway, but I'm going to clean... Oh, look where you walked into the cardboard pole. <laughs> <laughs> Are you a, a vlogger in the making, little man? And then I've got this candle to go, which I'll show you in a minute. It'll go up there. Um, we've currently got like a winter one. So I thought this one was cute and I love the colour. I actually made this order at like half three in the morning. Then one final cushion cover. What is it? Yeah. <laughs> Blow it out then. Blow it. <laughs> Blow it. <laughs> what is that? No, babe, that's not even nice. <laughs> yes, it is. I promise it's that's nice. That's like someone was making art in year six. <laughs> no, it will look cool. Trust me. So, yeah, I'll show you. Honestly, once the vision is all hey, together. That's not paper mache. It's cement like stone. Oh, this is the lampshade. Hopefully this will fit our fitting. If not, I think it's gonna go up there. But we'll have to see. Yay! Oh my god, it's so nice. That is gonna look so nice up there. I'll show you in a sec which one we've got right now, but this is the new vibe. I'm so excited. This is stuff that obviously 
the thing we have here is that it's not our forever home and um, we will be moving out this year or next year well probably this year to be honest um but this stuff i can all take with me and i love it all so much i'm really i just know as soon as i have my own house the interior design i'm gonna be like so obsessed with and i can't wait to like vlog that whole journey with you guys um <laughs> he's got chocolate all around his face is that fun where's noah gone where's noah boo where's noah gone boo <laughs> So this final thing is a vase because I've currently got a vase that I do love but it's stuffed with toilet roll because the pampas is quite short on it which I've just had a thought. I might switch that for the round one that we've got upstairs. Whoa! Oh my good lord. I, I didn't realise it was that big. We're going to have to get standing pampas for this. To go in the bedroom, like tall ones, which we can, we can cut down the road. You are next level, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god, I this was a little bit expensive. I mean, when I say that, it was like 25 quid or something, which for yeah. homeware isn't bad, but Get out of there. I understand now because this is huge. Look at it compared to my head. So, that is my HM haul. Sorry, it was a bit all over the place, but I'm gonna put all these things together and I'll show you everything once it's done. And I'm very excited about it. Let's get i'll show you everything before as well like i'm not unhappy with our lounge right now but i just wanted a few pieces just to just to jazz it up a bit i mean everything looks a bit messy but yeah let's just get this all tidied up and then i can show you everything afterwards so yeah this is going to be changing as well so i'll show you all that when it's done this has currently got the printer on it because i've been using the printer but i'll just show you it all in a second so this is the old lampshade there's nothing wrong with it just a bit basic a bit boring keep it though um yeah this is good to like having like hallways and stuff oh careful little man god knows by this why this fixing is gold by the way i think it was gold before yeah i know i mean i don't know why they chose to have it gold there we go super cute there we go everyone needs to be tidied so i think that's another job for tomorrow um but yeah i'm really happy with that so we had a little tidy up of the nursery today, just roughly. I need to go through and get more of these hangers because we've got like odd ones. I literally need to go through and I will, over the next few weeks, go through and order all like essentials I need for baby girl. But yeah, semi tidy in here I suppose. It's bath time. Would you like your toothbrush? Would you like your toothbrush? Oh, careful. Careful. Whoa, careful. Oh, you need to stop doing that. I'm going for a run after kebab. Are you? Yes. Yeah. Tomorrow. No, come go. Three days. I'm not ruining my thingy. Three days in a row. I'm doing. Why are you going now? I'm bath and Okay. And you're tidying up, aren't you? Yeah. No one. Ta. Good boy. Brush, 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 brush. <laughs> no what? Brush, 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 brush. Give me love, give me all your love, oh cause I want you No one else makes me feel this way, don't know what you do Hold my hand, could you hold my hand, look me in the eyes You and me, yeah that's all I need
It is Sunday and it's a very slow Sunday actually. I mean, it's half tenish. I'm absolutely shattered because I just slept so awful last night. Guys, this pregnancy, insomnia or whatever, I don't even think it's insomnia. Well, pregnancy insomnia. Well, it could be. But um, it's just that like uncomfort. That I'm, I'm so tired. It's literally three in the morning and I just can't comfortable look i've got a stitch right now so i'm currently on the sofa um something fell over in our bedroom and it woke me and connor up um and that's what's woke me up uh, but i just feel so awake but i feel so tired at the same time so i'm just watching my vlog back because it's ready to go live at 10 a.m we have got a food order coming between eight and nine i hate not being able to sleep the worst. Anyway guys, I'll see you in the morning. Hopefully I'll get a bit of sleep. We're just putting together our juicer because I'm making a new juice. Um, because we're trying to like just be a little bit more healthy. Yeah, we're trying to make healthier choices. Please ignore what I look like. I really need to sort my hair out. I went to bed with wet hair last night and this is half woken up. So yeah, we're making a like green juice. So I've got, actually let me show you what we've got. We've got cucumber, lemon, ginger, celery and pineapple. I might put a bit of honey in there just to make it a little bit sweeter. A little bit tired. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh. 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 Are you putting spinach in it, Bubby? Yeah, that's what I forgot. I've got spinach as well. You're tired, aren't you, little man? Have a kiss. Mwah. I can't remember whether you need to like peel the stuff and take the skin off. I think that's the whole point of that, bub. Yeah, but I did it with the lemon anyway. It squeezes it all out anyway. But I haven't with the ginger. I don't know how much ginger <laughs> it So my vlog has just gone live. So yeah, it's just, I'm getting things done even though I don't feel like it. I'm trying just to every day be on it, you know? I have to wait for Con. I've got my cute little mama pajamas on from the PLT maternity range. These are my new favourite pajamas ever. I have the I want to get the black versions of these, but I also have the shirt dresses. I have the white one and the black one. I'm pretty sure the black one is going to be coming in my hospital bag because it's so cute. How do you turn it on? Our green juices, they look pretty green. Should we give it a taste? Did you put ginger in it? Yeah. Are you just going down it? No. Oh. It's not that bad. It's not that bad, no, but it doesn't taste very sweet. I could drink that though. What do you mean? It doesn't taste very sweet. Well, I'll put pineapple in it. I think it's nice. To be fair, it's not actually that bad. We've got jacket potatoes for dinner. That's good. You've got your pizza. No, I'm having that for lunch. I'm not going to have yeah. all that today. I'm going to have two slices for lunch. Also, our Argos order came this morning. It actually came before I got up because I got up. I actually got up without Connor today, which is rare. I always get up when he gets up, but I was so tired this morning. Um, I slept till nine. Could have slept longer, but I just like to get things done. So yeah, our Asda order. Did I say Argos? I meant Asda. Our Asda order came this morning with all our meals for the week, all the veg, all the fruit. Gemma Miles has uploaded a video and she's my favourite to watch on YouTube at the minute. And speaking of, she commented on my photo yesterday. That was like a fangirl moment for me. So I'm going to put that on in the background whilst we're tidying. Or actually, there's quite a few videos up at the minute. So because it's 10am on a Sunday, that's my favourite when loads of videos go live. Um, mine's just gone live as well. But I'm going to put on a different video and then when I'm getting ready I'm going to watch Gemma's because I like to chill and watch Gemma's video. She makes me feel so like chill. <laughs> so yeah, I need to get on and clean. Because um, look at the state Noah's left this room in. I mean it's not that bad but I just want to tidy it all away. All 
to film I think I might feel better once I'm ready but I like to film when I'm like really wanting to film and I don't feel like that right now but um, I want to get this done so I will do it today okay you guys I really didn't want to leave you guys on a negative note like that like this morning and this well, this whole day has been uh, just one of those days it is now 10 to 7 and I've just finished filming. I literally had to have a break in between. I just had a cry, because I've just been so exhausted today. I just, I have not felt too great. Um, but I had some mini eggs and I had um, some Dr. Pepper and it seemed to spice me back up. I obviously, my sugar levels must have been quite low. Um, but yeah, I need to get editing this video. I hope it's okay. Not this one that I'm filming, the one I've just filmed. I hope it's okay do you know what there's some really really lovely stuff in it i hope you guys enjoyed it i know not all of you guys are pregnant but i wanted to help you mamas out because it is a lovely collection so thank you so much to plt for sponsoring that video i am now going to go downstairs connor wants to go for a run um connor wants to go for a run and i'm going to start looking through these this footage so i will see you guys in the morning um i have a midwife appointment tomorrow actually uh so yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. So, update. Do you know what? 2021, 2021 is the year we're in. It's going to be the year I sort my YouTube out. Everything possible, everything that could possibly go wrong on my YouTube channel goes wrong. Um, and I'm determined. Like, I've tried new lenses. I've tried new microphones. So even though I'm talking through it, you can hear this weird beeping noise throughout the whole video that I filmed today um, because it was sat on the ring light. So I have got a new microphone and obviously this, although in my last vlog I didn't really notice it with my Sony, I don't know what was going on, but I've put the microphone on my Sony and I'm going to try and film with this tomorrow and I'm going to send back the other lens if this works fine because I just can't be asked spending money on things that aren't going to work. So I'm going to try and film, sorry can't knock my camera, so I'm going to try and film on this tomorrow. Um, but yeah sorry for like the whole ramble. Today's just not been the best of days but it's fine, tomorrow is a new day, we can start again and it's a new week. Should yeah it's a good week a really good week so i'm i feel i feel good and i'm gonna see what this footage looks like now i've got the microphone i don't know if you can hear that we'll see oh my goodness i've just finished filming and i need to what's that i've obviously got my appointment so i need to sort everything else out now so it's tidy for when we get back later so yeah that was long and also i still had the same issue with the ring light i thought it was fine i'm just gonna have to get a new ring light it makes like a ring like a ringing noise um but it's not as bad in this one so hopefully i can get that sorted for you guys and my next video i promise i won't have the horrible noise <laughs> chai there's chai bye chai say hello Everything's alright I'll be right I swear I'll Hold me closer I wanna stay here with you All that we have is each other now I promise I won't leave your side so I'm back from the midwife 
appointment, sorry, the um, washing machine is on. Just about to watch Below Deck. Connor's lost his phone, what's new? Um, but little man is actually staying at my mum's tonight for childcare because I have my jabs in the morning. I've got my whooping cough and my flu jab. So obviously I can't take Noah with me. So obviously she had him today. So I'm gonna have to have, a, have her have him tomorrow. So he's just gonna stay there tonight. So it's just me and Con tonight. I mean, I would show you, but he's got his work top on. So I can't show you him. Um, and he's just made me a jacket potato with cheese, cucumber, lettuce, and onion, and mayo. No, I'll cut it for me. <laughs> what's, his, what's his stuff called? I don't know, but he's a good chef like me. I cook cotton a jacket potato. Hey, boy, girl, look. I'm just saying that. Oh. I'm not just saying that, I'm just busy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, Hello, guys. It is Tuesday. Do you know what? I feel really bad because this vlog has kind of just been quite... I haven't really done much. So I think I might extend this one through till tomorrow because obviously they've got, we've got something going on tomorrow that's quite exciting. Um, so I'm just going to extend this vlog to tomorrow as well just because otherwise this is just going to be... Oh my ear then. <laughs> this is just going to be quite a boring vlog and I feel my energy levels have not been as good as what they were in the other vlog but i just want to be open and honest and i want to talk to you guys that i'm if i'm vlogging every day then you're gonna see my everyday moods like not every day is really positive um like <sighs> the time is 25 past 7 i have been up since 3 a.m and i do not feel good about this so i'm moving my jabs because I am mean, going to try and get some sleep but I'm just doing my editing right now um, and my mum's just going to have Noah for the, most of the day today because I just need to catch up on some sleep I am just exhausted and I don't know I feel I don't want to no I'm not going to cry I don't know why I feel like I'm going to cry I love you see you later that's Connie's just gone off to work I don't know I'm just finding it a little bit harder at the minute and I don't even like to admit that I'm finding it hard because obviously I'm so grateful to be in the position that I'm in and oh I don't even want to cry I would never want anyone to think that I wasn't grateful and like I love being pregnant I am so like happy and I'm so in awe with everything right now but I just feel a little bit oh overwhelmed and I think it's just because I'm not sleeping properly and I just feel a lot achier and <laughs> I don't know I'm just silly I know I'm silly but yeah we had our midwife appointment yesterday and everything was really good so like I'm just I am so I haven't really got much to get like upset about but yeah I just feel a little bit overwhelmed and I'm so excited for her to just be here now um and I think the thing that's daunting to me is that I know it's still gonna get harder from here i have so much to be grateful for i should have a really exciting parcel coming today i should have my pretty little thing stuff coming through that i need to shoot so i will try and get some behind the scenes of that i'll show you the stuff getting my content for them i will like try and film some behind the scenes because i don't use this camera actually um and luckily connor's going to be home tomorrow because the exciting thing is happening um you guys will know what it is already because i'll probably have it in the title of my video but okay i can talk to you guys about it but um it's just so crazy i'll talk to you about it tomorrow though because it still doesn't feel real until it's here i'm not gonna feel it's, it's not gonna feel real i feel like my vlog right now is just like such a mix of emotions but that is just my life right now but yeah i'll try and get some behind the scenes of me shooting for plt tomorrow I don't know I don't know if you prefer people to be less emotionally involved in their videos I just like to be open and honest and as natural as possible um, but yeah I'm just watching Sophia and Chinsia's vlog I'm still editing my PLT video and that is the update for now I'm gonna try and finish this and I'm gonna try and get some sleep if not I'll just go to bed really early tonight like it's just not an issue but my main priority is getting some work done today right you guys i'm getting myself up i'm getting myself sorted i'm gonna have to film my little haul cleaning product haul on my phone because 
my camera is about to die and I want to get it all unpacked um, and I need to charge you guys up so I'm going to charge you up and I'm going to get the box in and I can see all my cleaning products that's the only thing that's motivating me right now because I can use them all and make the house more lovely <laughs> So this is all the bits I picked up. I didn't even realize I did this. Like honestly, my baby brain is next level this time. I can't even stress you guys, it's that bad. But um, I haven't picked up loads of stuff. Like I said, I'm gonna be doing another order from a different website, but similar sort of vibe. So I'll show you that when that comes as well, if you're interested. But yeah, so this is what I got. I got these obviously for now. And I just thought they were really handy to have like wipes that aren't for his bum, if that makes sense. And these child farm ones are biodegradable. Um, and I just thought, yeah, we always need some wipes to wipe his face. So I got them for little man. I just got this scour brush because we needed one basically. And I need to upgrade, I need to sort this out. So I'm gonna be doing that in a minute with all my new bits. Um, I also got these ones just cause I thought these ones are gonna be easy as well. I've got this one as well for cleaning. Um, and then I got these <laughs> just in case. So we're never gonna run out basically. I also got one of the electronic refillable lighters because we use these all the time to light candles and wax melts. Well, the tea lights for the wax melts. I got this for the toilet, which is so good. I got one of these. I actually have never had one of these and I don't know why. Connor's mom has one and it, when it goes off, it smells really strong. So I got this one in the scent soft cotton. I'm gonna put that in the hallway. Um, but yeah, I got these antibacterial sprays this is the one we've got at the minute we use this and we use the this one this is my absolute favorite method anti-back um that's in wild rhubarb i think i showed you that the other day but these are in the scent blue raspberry fizzy apple and then this one is bubblegum cola i then also just picked up a toilet bowl spray and then we've got we've got this cleaning product for the sides and then we've got the Dettol one as well um, we use the orange one of this at the minute and I love the scent of it. So I've got the apple one and then I got these two carpet cleaners. I've never smelled the unicorn dust one before, but I wanted to smell it. So yeah, that's my little mini like cleaning pool. I know that you are having a hard time right now. That everything seems to crumble around you I know that you feel all alone in this world but you have to put your trust into us and we will help you through cause we only want what's best what's best for you and clean minus these clothes these clothes need to be put in the wash this is all tidied and clean i need to drain the sink but i just like to leave my sephora in there to soak but the toilet's all clean it's got cleaning products down it the hallway is all clean if we can see and then the lounge is all clean and tidy too until little man gets back but it's fine also the kitchen is all clean too which is great i've just put on a wash so yeah all clean now so you guys my new ring lights come i'm gonna open it on camera with you guys sorry if you can see the washing on the background do you know what i know this is really random but i get questions about doing a house tour and honestly there's literally nothing to my house i haven't got a very big house we don't actually own this house either we are currently renting we are hoping to buy within the next year um but i don't want to rush into buying somewhere if we're not 100 percent in love with it um we should be able to start looking from april but obviously april is when baby girl is due so i think i'd rather just hold off hopefully we can stay here a little longer if not we'll just have to rent somewhere because it's not my home i don't feel like honestly compared to what this house was 
um i've mentioned i've mentioned this a few times but this house was all round yellow like everywhere the ceilings so if you see like patchy paint that's why because it was so hard to cover we have done so much to this house and i'm actually really proud of us for that um but until i get my own home i'm not really keen on doing house tour because there's not a lot to it so you guys won't find it that interesting basically but i think i might just try and set it up on my own and then I'll get back to you guys once I've done. Bring me in, bring me out. Whoa, look at your dancing. Woo, woo, woo. Yay! Oh, mummy got makeup all over your clean outfit. <laughs> <laughs>